Champions come in all shapes and sizes. I feel the bounce and it, and it feels fun. Are these your running blades or your walking blades? I borrowed these. 275 athletes from 19 states and three countries make up this fourth Angel City Games. I was in a car accident when I was young and I was an athlete before I got hurt. And for 12 years there were no sports that I knew of. And I was that kid that needed sports and we're trying to make sure that nobody's left on the sidelines. Wheelchair basketball is one of five different adaptive events being held at UCLA over the next four days. You don't have to win, you don't have to be the first to cross the finish line to feel good about yourself. My favorite race was my Olympic silver medal because it was so much better than what people were expecting. We initially met Rudy Garcia Tolson when he was a 10 year old. Now this six time Paralympic medalist is here to help walk the walk about making it through life without legs. In the sports office at ABC7, I have a poster of you that says, no legs, no limits. How many times do you share that message with these young athletes? You know, all these kids, they embody no legs, no limits. I mean, they, 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 are, they are the no limits in the world today. They are the inspiration, and I believe the world needs some inspiration right now. Over 400 people were inspired to volunteer. It creates a community that transcends a scoreboard. You know, one of the unique things about being involved in the disability community is very rarely do people with different physical disabilities ever get together. The only place they really aggregate is in sport. So when they come here, all of a sudden they're a community and they're all athletes together. And you don't have to look very far to see they are all overachievers. Kurt Sandoval, ABC7 Eyewitness News.